Hey you, how's it going today guys? Welcome back to the Breath of the Wild semi-casual playthrough with your boy Goob. And uh, I feel like I fixed the audio settings. Um, this is episode 8 and episodes... Episode 1 the mic audio is real low compared to the game audio. Episode 2 I tried to balance it and uh, they were both quiet. Uh, when I was listening to them in playback on my computer, they sounded fine through my headphones, and then I tried to play it through YouTube, and they were all just so quiet. Every episode, two through seven, and two had already gone up, but I pulled back down three through seven, ran them through a process to increase the gain on the audio, and they're a little bit better. I, I hope that they turn out okay, but we are back to a different setup. Uh, I'm using OBS this time instead of the Elgato software. I figured Elgato would be the best way to go since I'm using their capture card. But uh, clearly I can't get the audio settings right. So I flipped back to OBS where I have the audio settings for the mic set up pretty well. Um, so hopefully it sounds good in this episode. We're about to find out. And uh, I'm going to get right into it. We were doing the, uh, the Korok Trials. So it's time for the Trial of Wood. I guess I can throw away the ladle. We have room for a bow. Traveler sword or shield is pretty damaged. All right. Yes. I think after we finish the Korok trials, we are going to go to Hot to Know, deal with that, meet Pura, get the the um. Sheikah Slate upgrade for the pictures. Um, then I need to get ancient parts so that I can get like the bomb and stasis upgrades, things like that. But um, I believe after we do Para, the next thing I'm gonna try to focus is is getting the climbing set, the full set. And uh, speaking of the climbing set, I need key swings to upgrade the armor. So this is perfect. I didn't even think of using this uh, this area to consistently get some key swings. I don't know if I can redo this. Like, I don't know if the enemies will spawn back after I complete this trial. If they do, uh, that'll be nice. Oh, you can't climb those? I thought you could. That's fine. I think there has to be space. There we go. Wow, I didn't know they could get up here. Learning all kinds of new things today. Yep. I don't want to deal with these guys. Okay, they do have elemental arrows. I wasn't sure if they were going to have elemental arrows since I'm not in... in master mode. I'm going to kill him because I want the Chuchu Chili. Last time I did this, I, um... I came here with Lord. with Rivali's Gale, and uh, I gotta tell you, it makes this a lot easier. Come on, if that arrow had hit us, we'd be done. Um, Let's eat this, and um, wow, how, did, how is that not a headshot? That one I can see not being a headshot. I goofed it. Get out of my face, please. I'm having the worst time right now. Alright, bullet time is the way to go. kind of want that key swing because you need all the different types all right, and this stupid guy how am I missing I never use this bow so I don't really know the distance that well okay wow he took forever to hop up get out of here 
I am sick of it. All right, now we can go casual strats on this. Um, I feel like I'm gonna. That was. I feel like that second one was, or the first one was too far away, and I was just gonna fall in after clearing this all up manually. This guy, get out of here. I use so many arrows unnecessarily in this challenge. The funny part is I can boomy zoomy through most of this without too much of a hassle, but I feel like we're skipping a lot of stuff, and I'd like to play some of the game casually, and that's the point of a semi-casual playthrough, is that it's not all just running past, skipping. There it is. Okay, those are fire arrows. I thought they were bomb arrows. Oh. This is what I want. Kind of wanted that choo choo jelly, but I'd rather just complete the trial. I really do hope the uh, recording sounds good in this one. I'm trying to get all of these done before the end of the week and I go out of town for this week and next week. And um, I was on a good pace and I had to stop to re-upload a bunch of those. But I think that switching back over to OBS will really clear that issue up since the audio settings were good and the fire red Nuzlocke is as far as I could tell. Uh, nobody complained about the audio levels. Alright, we will take that. And we get another orb. <laughs> the only thing, I can't seem to find a good mix on this mic to where I like sound clear and loud enough but also don't pick up every little sound of like my chair and my controller and all that and um i don't think it's a huge deal but it does bug me a little bit whenever i'm listening back i want to get crisp audio without picking up every little sound i'm gonna warp back here there's one more trial um let's see we did Trial of wood, trial of follow, the trial of follow mission, the trial of patience. That is the last one, I'm trying to think. I keep thinking of the, the woods right north of here where you have to do it in darkness. Um, it's the one down here. Oh, it's the trial of sight something like that where you have to follow the metal boxes how do i get into that one let's see here is the main entrance so it's up here somewhere keep going one of these if you go past it don't see the next spot hope it's this way oh there's one I'm modeling get out of here guy thanks for the bow and a few moblin pieces oh it was right there
Is this the one that the the Korok mask is is nearby? I remember like we go that way when we finish it, but I'm pretty sure maybe it's this clearing here. Nope, nope, nope. Okay, saved it. Somewhere around here. Oh man, that's a lot of mob ones. Okay, we're just going to keep moving. I know somewhere around here is one of the... The... I think it's the Korok mask from the DLC. I'm not dealing with pole arms. Go away. Nice try. Alright. I don't want that. I want... Where are those key swings? Yeah, those are the items I want. Okay. I don't think we have room for the shield, so we need to do... Magnesis. You can just pick it up and then drop it in the tree, but... I don't want to feel like dropping the shield. Unskippable cutscenes, they are bane of my existence. Alright, so we have to put this chest in that tree. I don't think it specifically has to be this chest, but a chest in that tree, and this one's here, so. I wonder if you could just skip this with an amiibo, now that I'm thinking about it. Oh yeah, if you didn't know, you could do that. Um, it's a lot faster. You can make really fast boats doing that, and you can move things you shouldn't normally be able to move by magnesising something between you and the thing that you're trying to move. That's how you do the uh, infinite guardian pieces glitch. You use a shield or a chest to push one of the ruined guardians. While I'm here, I really should uh, look for the stealth fin trout. Because those are rare and they're used to upgrade the Sheikah armor. But I don't feel like doing that. I probably won't max out the Sheik armor in this playthrough. And I'm pretty sure that's for the last upgrade. Alright, we have completed the Korot Trials. Wonderful. And we get another giant ancient core. That is also nice. I don't understand why they break this into two separate cutscenes. I wish that they would just make it one that you could skip. Alright, so from here we are going to warp back to Kakariko because I don't think that I updated the quest marker to go to Hatano. Um, and in any case, I think that that's our fastest route to head to Hatano. And we need to use the shrine to gather more stamina while we're there. I honestly don't think it's important to update the quest marker. I'm pretty sure if you go to Hatano and 
use the blue flame to open Pura's or activate Pura's workshop that it automatically updates. Right, we're going to use both of these to get stamina. I think I'm going to stick to the plan of finishing out the second wheel. And then once we have the second wheel, we will gather a couple hearts. I could, if I really felt like it, do the stamina, heart, energy, duping in Hatano. And we could get a bunch really quickly, but... I have a feeling that I'm going to do a bunch of shrines in this run through anyway, so there's no reason to really rush that. Um, Hatano is over here somewhere. Uh, this isn't the shrine on the top of the mountain. I would really like to get these because it makes... I can, I can wind bomb from the top of this mountain pretty much all the way to the tower. Like, I think I make one stop in the middle if I do it right. So I think we're going to warp back there and try to go for the gusto. And we're probably going to die trying because I have a track record of that so far. Oh, I remember why I didn't do these shrines. It's fine. Because I don't, I don't have to do them, I just need to get the warp point up there. I didn't do it because you have to go to both to know the solution. And I was going to look it up because I didn't feel like doing it casually. Actually, I'm pretty sure that I can boomy zoomy in that in those shrines and not even have to do it so yeah am i looking at the right direction i think this is east don't flick the controller well we failed and by we i mean me i wouldn't i wouldn't put that failure on y'all but it's fine because this cliff isn't very steep so we can whistle sprint right on up it. Up, up, up. Just climbing a mountain. I really need to get the rest of the climbing set. It'll make my life easier when I fail wind bombs like that. And since I seem to be failing a lot more than I felt like I was going to, um, it's important that I do that. Getting more stamina is very helpful for that too. Um, I'm actually going to have to climb here. I love the atmosphere of this game. Maybe I should have climbed over here. It looks less steep. I think I can... Yeah. This is where we want to be. We'll get there eventually. We're not booming or zooming, but we are getting there. No. The worst thing in Breath of the Wild. The rain at an inopportune time. Oh, God. Okay. Two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, come on. Come on. I need to go in a direction in which I can whistle sprint so that I can gather stamina again. No, 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 no. I think that rain in this game is a fine mechanic, and in general it adds atmosphere, but getting it at inopportune climbing moments is absolutely just the worst. 
because it slows you down in such an infuriating way. And the uh, the full climbing set upgraded does does negate that a lot. Like it makes it easier because you lose less stamina when you jump. But I don't think it's enough. I feel like they should have something a little more to really just like solidify that you've overcome the rain. And I think that like a classic Zelda upgrade system might be really helpful there. Like adding some kind of gloves that you get that you can find. Um, and even just put it in your uh, your key items menu and where you can you can turn it on or off as necessary for hardcore players just like the um, the champion abilities I think that that would be a huge boon I did see um, I was watching small ant the other day and on his stream somebody asked what he would want in Breath of the Wild 2 and he mentioned a grappling hook or a, or a hook shot and I feel like that would be a cool addition to climbing. I think that a grappling hook could be useful in the situation that I'm talking about like making the rain a little bit less tedious. Okay yeah so we can get over there I just have to Line it up and not blow it. Let's eat some apples. Oh, this might be a bad one. Or it might work perfectly. Oh! <laughs> well, I'm surprised we didn't take more damage. It was actually perfect. We had a lot of speed. And that's how you solve this shrine. That is the correct solution to the puzzle, just so everyone knows. And I believe these shrines have weapons in them, which I'm not super interested in. I could probably swap out the um, the sword I just got from the Korok trial. But having a wooden sword is also pretty nice. I think I have some ancient swords. Uh, anything that's not metal for when it's storming. Okay. So I think we're gonna wind bomb. The problem is this is not a cardinal direction. So it might not work. You know what? Let's save. Cover my bases real quick. This looks like a good angle. Good enough. Good enough. I don't think that I can I can sprint up this it's slow going but we're not falling down oh now we're starting to fall down we're so close come on you can do it link I believe keep blowing on your hands there is no Korok over here, right? I can never remember. It always feels like there should be one. Alright, now I'm actually going to need to get some height, which is what I've been failing at lately. So we will save again, just in case I completely blow it and not in the good way. Oh, I don't have any health. Oh my god, I can't believe that opened. That was almost good. Um, let's think about this. Alright, I kinda... I need the money. I was gonna... I was gonna reload the save, but while I'm here I should gather these. Because we are a little low on funds. I need to eat so that I don't kill myself. I feel like I made more food than this. 
Um, but I guess I didn't. I might... Hey, somebody from the future remind me that I need to cook more food. Um, don't know if I'll have a spot to cook during this video, but if I if I stop in Hatano, which I don't think I'm going to get to because we're 25 minutes in, um, I should be able to cook there, and I'd like to do it in between episodes. So I don't, but I don't think that's going to happen because we're going there. Ooh. Probably at the beginning of the next episode. If I get this right, we can finish this shrine before this one's over. I just need to get some height. And I'm, you know what? Time to look at the main screen instead of the recording. Alright. I think that's good. I think we got a good angle. Yeah. No, no, no. Come on. And it's back to cloudy weather, so this is perfect. Well, not perfect. If it was perfect, we would have made it up that ledge instead of hitting it, but we were close enough. And that's what really matters. A wise man once said, Good enough. Good enough. And that wise man was me. Oh, goodness. Letting go of that little lip almost dropped me down all the way. I think that it gets colder once I get up here. Or maybe it's when I get on top of that next little lip. Which I am going to go on real quick and do the Korok, and then we'll come back down and do the Shrine. Oh, it doesn't get colder. I thought it got to the second stage. Roommates moving around. I hear him. Just miss this apple. There we go. Thank you. And I will be taking these back. Thank you for your patronage. I'm going to eat both of those to do this boomy zoomy. I really should get at least one more heart. Having to scarf apples after every attempted wind bomb. Not a not my smartest move. Come on. Beautiful. Ooh, we took a lot of damage there, though. We hit the ground pretty hard. And that is the intended strategy for the shrine, if you didn't know. This is how you're supposed to do it. You can actually do that wind bomb from the ground, um, from that little slope. But I haven't been getting height on mine very well, so figured to go a safe route and climb up to the top. Alright, so here's the plan. It is time to cut the episode, but instead of cutting the episode here, I am... Actually, I'm not going to do what I thought I was going to do. I'm going to go get this Korok. We'll get this Korok and then we'll call it. So if you liked the video, leave me a like. If you didn't, leave a dislike. Um, helps me out in either case. If you want to comment, chat with me about your day, you can do so. If you want to subscribe, you can do that too. I'm not your mom. I won't tell you to do it. But uh, it does help me out. And I would appreciate it. And that is all I have to say about that. Let's... Watch this rock score a goal. Is it going to go wide? No, it's good. We're good. Yeah. Nailed it. 
Anyways, hope you guys are having a good day. Hope you continue to have a good day. And I will see you in the next one.